Can you be successful in Metro Royale as a solo player? I wouldn't suggest it, but you guys know me. I'm going to always try it. I mean, hey, YOLO, right? Solo YOLO? Well, you're going to see that in this video. Uh, but my suggestion to you is to get a steady team every night to play with full of like-minded players that want to succeed in this game mode because you will run into enemy teams just like that and they are well organized. As a solo player, you will be outgunned, outnumbered, and outflanked, pinned down until they kill you. So you have to be very savvy as a solo player to be able to survive and get loot. So let's get into the video. All right, here we go, guys. Uh, when you're solo YOLOing as I am here, make sure you're carrying uh, purple or high explosive ammo in your weapon, whether it's blue, um, whether it's green, or purple or pink. Make sure that you've got at least purple ammo in it. That is high explosive, and that will shred uh, enemy teams that have level 4 or below if you run into level 6 geared guys, more than likely they're going to have MKs and they're going to just destroy you. And so it doesn't matter. But right here I can tell these guys aren't your typical squad. They are shooting anything but MKs. So I figured, okay, I will come in and see if I can take them down. I kind of felt that they were low geared just because of the weapon choices that they had. Uh, and right here, I'm going to spot a couple. There's a guy over there, and there is a guy uh, to my right. And I'm just trying to use the third-person peek to pan. Uh, you, you have to play very sweaty uh, when you're doing solo YOLOs, amigos. Play very sweaty. Hear him? It's very close. There he is by that crate, looting. See him? I already know. He's not fully geared just by the color of his outfit. I can see the color of his outfit. So either he is level 2 or level 3 geared. He is not level 4. This guy's trying to flank me. Um, he's going to catch it to the dome. And right here I reload. And this guy almost kills me with an AK. I don't even think that he has um, explosive rounds in it. Uh, it really surprised me, but right here I'm going to met up and then I'm going to do what they call a hucklebuck, which is, which is what I call a hucklebuck. It's a euphemism I use for just repositioning and trying to catch somebody off guard. Let me get this boost off, get my health back up, and then I'm going to engage. Watch, this guy has no idea. And that's the end of that that team. Other, there is a player uh, outstanding because uh, I thirsted that guy. Uh, but as I loot these guys, I find out that there's literally... Um, I, I didn't get the guns or the explosive ammo. He could have kept it in his lockbox. Not sure. But the way that he hit me there and almost killed me, I kind of felt that he had some some uh, some good goods when it comes to ammo. But I didn't find any. That's all I'm saying. Now, I do know there's a fourth player, and I'm being very cautious here. Pay attention to the time on the edit. You'll notice um, towards the end, I kind of hang around here a little bit trying to uh, to kill this, this fourth player. I felt that he was in the area, um, but he, I, I didn't catch him here. I actually catch him outside of the base. We do tangle. And look at this. They left, they left this. I... Sh I don't think I'd looted this complete base. I should have. Never pass a file cabinet, guys. There's key cards and all kinds of great stuff in those file cabinets. This one has a pocket watch. Not so great. And look at this, guys. I miss I miss uh, this ammo box right there or whatever they call it. It has like guns and gun parts. But sometimes you'll get an improved or refined weapon out of them. But right here, there is the fourth member. He's hopping along, having a good time. And I noticed that wonderful backpack. I engaged this guy with blue ammunition. Uh, so that, that I already knew he was low geared. And I was able to take him down very cheaply. And by the way, I'm fixing to gain a really nice level 5 backpack. This is one thing about solos I like. Because 
you get your gear. Nobody tries to take your gear because you're by yourself. The only bad thing is, is if you run into a level six team with MKs, you are dead. So yeah, there, there's no overcoming them. If you have level six armor with an MK, maybe, but they really wear you down typically. And if you see them running that way, they're super, super aggressive as well. So right now I'm going to take a blue or a, um, the path of least resistance. I actually swim across the water. Um, I try to stay in cover as a solo player and I make it to Razak Hill. Razak Hill gives me a uh, defilade over the whole map. It is the centralized lo location, um, to where I can hear shots from any direction pretty much. And I can choose to engage or to evade. That is my decision at that point. Plus, you got some loot up here, guys. I mean, look at there. 4,000, whatever the other one was, 2,500. And I'm going to get out of here. Let's see what my net earnings earnings was. I got this nice level 5 backpack uh, and a drop down here. And let's take a look. Uh, 173K. That's, that's not bad. You know, and a backpack. I'll take it. Um, it's really, you don't really get those super, you know, million dollar runs, um, like doing solo because you're trying to evade. You don't go to all the hot spots where the best loot is. You're kind of running the outskirts and hoping to pick off some enemy teams that are, um, you know, easier to take down. But right here, I'm, I drop down in gear. As you see, I'm running level, uh, level three gear with a level four backpack. And um, I'm going straight into Razhawk because I feel like with this loadout, I don't have a lot to lose. I'm only at 177k. Um, this, uh, this is like a really uh, cheap loadout. I almost made that on the last run, so I'm not really fearful here. And sure enough, I catch one of them right here, take him down. I am using um, high explosive rounds. As you see, that's purple on my magazine. Uh, anytime I deal with teams, I go ahead and use that to take them quickly. Now I'm doing the huckle buck as we, with, as we learned earlier, that's my signature move. When I shoot you, I'm, I'm, I'm flanking. I'm not going to stay because if you stay static, it makes you an easy target. Now I didn't find his team in the boss's lair, but guess what? Here's one of his teammates. Hey bro, I got you. No, 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 no. I got you. That's, that's what happened here. Poor fella. He actually just gives it up. Watch this. He just stops moving. He's just like, all right, bro. Go ahead. There you go. Now, he was at thirst, and I was extremely concerned that um, that there would be another player here. And this is usually when they get you right here. Oh, look at that Groza. Let's get it. Grenades. Always pick up grenades, guys, so you don't have to buy them. Lots of gear on this guy. Oh man, he's gonna. I'm gonna have to loot a while on this dude. He's looking delicious. All right, so my lockbox isn't full right here, so that's a huge mistake that I'm making in this game. I'm not utilizing my lockbox as of this point. Oh yeah, he's got goods. All right, so I must have put it in there to be sure. Oh look at there, I had a flare gun. Didn't even know it. But right here, guys, I am I am really nicely looted. As you know, I had around 177, yeah, 177 on my uh, on my loadout value. Um, so I decided at 300,000 that I would go ahead and get out of here. This is enough for me. I made a profit, and you're you, this is a grinding game. It's a grinding game. Uh, so when you when you come out ahead. You're alive. You still have your gear. Yeah, go ahead and make a move. Get out of there. Uh, I want to hear from you guys. Uh, do you enjoy Metro as much as I do? Uh, if you don't, let me know why in the comments. And if you do, let me know why in the comments. If you are enjoying this video, please smash the like button. Uh, let me know from you guys uh, that you are enjoying the content. Uh, share with your friends if you will. I'm trying to grow the channel and definitely um, 
definitely let me hear from you. Uh, subscribe if you like it. If you don't like it, don't subscribe. But if you do like it, subscribe. And stay tuned for each and every video that I make. But right here, let's see what the ROI is, guys. Um, yeah, mission successful right here. And I made 200,000. That is a win, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll see you.